for you. He's looking at me. He's saying, eat me, eat me. Welcome to another dark kitchen, but this time around, the difference is, right, I've ordered on Uber, but I've come to check out these guys. They're called X-Wings. They're making some mental claims. They're saying they've got the best wings in Birmingham. Follow me. This is great. Let's go. Follow me. I found the guy that's made these claims. You guys must be X-Wings. We are, yeah. How are you? How nice to meet you. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Yes. Sorry, I'm just... What is it that you're doing? I'm just about to make some fresh tenders here now for some you. Some fresh tenders? Yeah, which will be tossed in some fresh flour. So let me get this right, right? Places, yeah. You guys are making some mental claims. We you're are, saying yeah. that your tenders and your wings are the best in Birmingham. Absolutely, yes. Absolutely. They're not backing off the claim, right? They are saying that's absolutely right. So we've got the right place at least. This is our first branch. Your first branch? Yeah, this is our first branch as a ghost kitchen. Yeah. Okay. And this is where we're starting from here. Yeah. You guys busy? We are busy, yes. What is it that you're doing inside of here? I can see you've got some chicken tenders yeah. and you're covering them with some batter. Yeah, I'm actually giving it a, a good coating of, of our Can you tell me what's, what's, that, what's in the batter itself or is that a top secret? It's a secret. It's a secret. It's a, it's a secret. So yeah. what's the difference between your your tenders and wings and something I can get from KFC, for example? Yeah, we're, as you can see, we're, we're nearly purely fresh, straight in front of you. Okay. Yeah, it'll be cooked delicately and subtly. Yeah. So what's what's on the actual chicken itself? Is that a secret yeah. recipe as well? The chicken is actually marinated overnight in some spices. Okay. Of our own spices. All right. And basically, the next day it's cooked, it's marinated, it's got the taste, it's right. got the tenderness, it's got the juice in there. Right. And as you can see, you know when, when they'll come out, they'll be nice and crispy and golden. Oh yeah. yeah. As you can see, we've got some samples here already done. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know you know what. KFC, you better watch out with the geezer. Look like they know what they're doing with the chicken. I've ordered, wait for it, rocket fuel, buffalo blast off, sticky barbecue, flaming mango and lime, blistering lemon and herb, and scorching sriracha. My goodness, me. I'm going to go for all of them. I'm going to check them all out, haven't I? Right? Wish me luck. It's time to eat. Guys, I'm out trying to discover new food places. Do not forget to hit the like, subscribe, and the bell icon. Here comes the rest of your video. In the dark kitchen, there's no eating in. Like, you order it at home or at work. But they've been kind enough to let me try it out in their kitchen. First up is a tenders, right? Oh yeah, they smell beautiful. They are soft. Right, I've got all sorts of different sauces. I have no idea which one's which, but I'm going to try to guess them. Have a look at that bad boy. That was sticky barbecue. Mm. You better come back in. That tender is so soft. <laughs> I'm gone back. I'm literally out. What's this one? Look at these sauces. They are mental. Look at them dips. Right. Mm. Mm. 
coming in now. I can't get over it. There's such a lovely light crunch. It's a it's a crunch, but it's light. But that chicken in there, it's so soft. Right, let's try this. This looks real hot. Look at that. Okay, try again. That's what I'm talking about. Got some super rocket fuel. Oh yeah. That chili but so it goes so well with this. This is so soft. And then you've got the crispy light batter. Let's have a look. Lemony, sweet. I don't know what sauce that was. Oh yeah. But you have to try this to believe it. These are. Right, I'm gonna go for the mental. Turbo, whatever it's called. So that there. Even the size of it. Right? People get the tenders wrong. They cut them too thin. Look at the size of it. It's so juicy. It's full of flavour and then sauces work so well with it. You know what? Don't be shut up. Let's try some more. sitting at home and order some wings and then they show up like this it's no more boring wings anymore right they've corrected me so this is called buffalo blaster style to try the wings i don't know what's better the sauce or the chicken itself mm. the buffalo blast exactly what it says on the tin it's a blast in your mouth but they're not on the overkill of chilies i'm not dying but I can feel it, right? Because wings can be quite boring. So something did need to give them a bit of a blast. Same principle, right? The, the chicken is soft. The light coat and batter. Right? They're using the same stuff as the tenders. I've got loads of flavors to go through. Let's go. Lemon and herb. Mm. Lemon and herb is actually so thin to the crispy batter. And that is, oh yeah, that definitely works better with the wings instead of the buffalo blast. I definitely like this one at the moment. I'm scared. This one's called rocket fuel. Same concept, sticking with the wings, but rocket fuel type. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah. It's going to have Ah. I need to smell a bit, right? With all the garnishings and everything, so fresh. Mm. You know what? Rocket fuel, that was gonna kill me, but I don't. I think we've got another two flavors to go. Let's do it. It's gone all exotic here. And this time around, it's all mango and lime. Look at it, just look at the the thickness of this sauce first of all. Listen that. I think that would be the major difference with these guys and other people that is literally sticking to it. Sweet and sour going on. Big difference. Right. The chicken is still crunchy. I've got a crunch. I've got a, a dense sauce. Oh, come back in. Look at this. Look at this sauce. 
I think I've got one more to go. Let's do it. Why don't you do the whole American thing, right? And go for the sticky barbecue as well. Well, we've gone for every flavor that they do. So you have to make your mind up. I guess, man, the barbecue, right? Nothing better than chicken and barbecue sauce, right? That's the one. Mm. I'm going to my bed. I don't care. Yeah. Oh yeah. Sweet and sour, sticky, barbecue, right? Egg sauce. That's the one. That's gonna be my favorite one. Give me some prices. Seven wings, fries, and a can of beer. $9.99. You know what? Their sauces. You haven't tried them. You gotta you gotta try their sauces in order to appreciate that sauce. I just want to show you the consistency of that sauce. Look at that. Look how thick that sauce is. Oh yeah. It's looking at me. It's saying, eat me, eat me. That the chicken is that soft. The batter is that crispy. I'm you know what? It's definitely worth it. X Wings, I said, what the hell are you playing at? You haven't ordered any loaded fries and this young lady here is the loaded fry expert on yes, you exactly. right if the you know like anything the best loaded fries in birmingham yes. you did what in birmingham the best loaded fries the best loaded fries in birmingham yeah best wings best loaded fries is there anything wrong with this place i don't know right you don't have to make your money let's try it What can I see on there? I can see them tenders, what we had first. You know what, the tenders were unbelievable. I have not had tenders like that. You cannot beat their tenders. They were beautiful. Look at the garnishing. And what they're telling me now, this is a different sauce. This is the X sauce from X wing. Mm. Skin on fries, right? Good quality fries. And that sauce, it's not overpowering, it's very, very subtle, very creamy. Oh, that's good. Them tender. What can I say? I would just come back to this place just to have their tender. I've had an overdose of wings, and they're telling, they're telling me, right, they haven't finished yet. They got something called collie, collie bombs. I'm assuming this is cauliflower. Right? Collie bums? How can you do this to cauliflower? I feel sorry for the cauliflower. What? I don't know, you know. Does anybody else in Birmingham do collie bombs? I don't think they do. But I'm gonna try it without the sauce first and see what, what they're like. Mm. Oh wow. Same use of the batter, but a soft cauliflower inside. You geniuses. Let's dip it in some sauce. Mm. You know what? Thinking out the box. I'm thinking out the cauliflower, one of them. Right? Let's try this one. So different, but it's nice. Whole concept again: outer crunchy, soft layer; inner soft. Right? That's a whole concept. Yeah. I had an overdose of wings, cauliflower, fries, everything as you do on the weekend. That has been X wings. Where do I start? I'm gonna start with the wings first of all, right? 
five or six different kinds of sauces. So the wings all work the same. The best thing about the wings has to be the batter. Now imagine KFC batter, imagine KFC batter, but better, right? It's not falling off the thing. It's lightly battered, but it's crispy at the same time. It's, it's, it, you've got to try it, right? And the different sauces. I would go for definitely like the mango, the barbecue. That would really suit me really more better than the other ones. Then the cauli bonds, right? The cauliflower bond. I've never tried them in that manner, but I tell you what, I was pleasantly surprised about this cauliflower. I would have had cauliflower just like that. I don't think you would as well, right? And even my kids enjoy the cauliflower. Imagine that, kids eating cauliflower. That's one way of doing it. Right, thirdly, got to be the showstopper, has to be the chicken tenders. If you've not tried their chicken tenders, you need to travel and try their chicken tenders. Order the chicken tenders from x Wings. right? Smashed it really out of the park. The size of them, the juiciness, the whole sauces. You know what? I can't afford them. Overall, this is what they are scoring. You're watching him right. I carry on watching the big reviews. I'm a stone fan and they didn't even give me a cheese. Oh, nice <laughs> serious